Hello YouTubers, I'm going to show you how to put a NES emulator on your PSP along with putting ROMs with that NES em emulator. Well, let's begin. You're going to want to open up your Mozilla Firefox or your Internet Explorer in the Internet Browser. This is Mega Upload. I'm, I'm just going to put the link on the description box on the right. But if you're too lazy to look, it is megaupload.com slash question mark lowercase d equal sign capital S O U letters I mean number six and then capital T W T M. That's it. And yeah. You're gonna wanna click this regular download and put in your little weird thingy if you can read it and then say download file so you're going to want to click regular download click regular download and then if you're using Mozilla this will pop up and uh, you want to say open with RENRAR and say ok it's going to download it, I already downloaded it so I'm going to just exit out and afterwards this should pop up all these files, these are all the emulators for the PSP this is the Nintendo 64 emulator, Daedalus, the DS emulator, which is still has some kinks, the Decimu me, whatever, Nestor J, which is the emulator we're going to be working with, and then we have SNES 9XTYL, which is the Super Nintendo emulator, and then you have the UO under um whatever. It's the it's the Game Boy Advance emulator. Let's just say that you can emulate all of these to already have all the emulators or you can just click Nestor J which is what I'm going to do because I'm showing you how to do the Nest one so you say extract to desktop and then it should be on your desktop right there you're going to want to open it up and if it has this stuff in it you're good but just do this for right now click new right click on the open area in this window and say new and then click folder and do do all caps ROMs okay now you're going to want to minimize this for right now and then plug up your PSP after your PSP has been plugged up this window should pop up and you want to open up your folders to view files and then all this crazy mumbo jumbo will pop up and click PSP open up your game file when you open this and then you're going to want to drag and drop Nestor J into this I already have Nestor J in there so that doesn't need to be done that's showing since you have Nestor J in there you can now download games that can be done by going to this website right here www.rombomb.com link is going to be provided as well on the right side on the description screen you're going to want to click ROMs on the left side come on baby you can do it alright let's say well since we're dealing with the NES system you're going to want to click Nintendo click Nintendo and let's say I want to download Mega Man I'm going to click this click the M and then scroll down and I'll find Mega Man. You click Mega Man and then you're going to click Mega Man U. Then you'll have a verify code come up which mine is 049 and then you want to click verify and download. Since I already downloaded this file it's just going to be popping up well pop up <laughs> Haha, <laughs> bada bing bada boom. It's gonna be a pop it's gonna pop up on your desktop right there. You wanna wanna drag that into your Nestor J folder on your PSP. You're gonna wanna drop that into your ROMs. And since mine's already in my ROMs, it'll be right here. Mega Man U Ness. Okay. Now you're going to want to play with your PSP and you're going to want to exit out. 
and eject your PSP system. And then, yeah. Okay. Sorry about the video quality. Click game underneath well click memory stick underneath your game folder and then you'll see the Nestor J thing. Click Nestor J. And wait for it to load. And then you can pick the games. Like we downloaded Mario. I mean not Mario, we downloaded Mega Man. And now we can play Mega Man. Alright, comment and enjoy.